deliberations between the M23 rebels and the Kinshasa government delegations aim at returning peace in the Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo has kicked off here in the capital, Kampala, at the Commonwealth Resort Hotel in Munyonyo. The M23 rebels has over 25 members, while the Kinshasa government have uh, 18 members who have shown up here on the peace talks that are taking place just right now. But um, according to the mediator, the defense uh, minister of Uganda, Dr. Crispus Chionga, has just said that uh, the deliberations are going to take place in three phases. The first phase, therefore, will be working out what we call ground rules and the agenda. And in my view, I would target that it should take us like one day because the issues are known, they are not new to all of us. The second phase will be now the substantive talks because once we have our agenda, then we get into the talks right away. Uh, the talks uh, have taken place in three categories over the last uh, three to four days that they are going to be uh, sitting here at the Commonwealth Resort uh, Hotel in the capital, Kampala. Then later they will be shifted to Goma where some uh, element of implementation will also be done. Let us also hear from uh, the mediator, Dr. Chris Pastyonga, how uh, deliberations will uh, move on once they are shifted to Goma. We shall start in Kampala, and at a time we shall agree, the meetings will shift to Goma in the DRC. Dr. Chris Pasiwanga also tells us here that actually there are five points which they are going to look at in the three days that are going to be here trying to forge our way forward in returning peace in Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo. But the first point is that the ICGLR is determined to assist in stabilizing Eastern DRC and also in stabilizing more generally the ICGLR sub-region in line with the Pact on Security, Peace, Stability and Development. Uh, after Dr. Chris Paskionga, who is uh, the chief mediator in these talks, uh, giving his keynote address, uh, the Congolese head of delegation, who is the Minister of Foreign Affairs, Raymond Tishibanda, also raised onto the podium and gave his keynote address. In his keynote address, he showed a commitment uh, to listen to some of the grievances that are, be, are going to be raised by the M23 rebels and will, at the end of the day, uh, show or whether they are going to have mutual understandings on how they can return peace in the Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo. A y travailler en tout temps et en toutes circonstances. Nous venons donc à ce dialogue avec la ferme volonté de contribuer à une solution à la crise. Murazo Franco has also showed some element of commitment to having the war end, but at a little time he uh, diverted. A further grave concern remains. Without dealing with root causes, peace can never be durable. Malheureusement, face à ces diagnostics fait par la communauté internationale et le Miranda, ainsi que des correspondances qui ont été par les autres parties, À la COP du 23 mars 2009, le président de la République, dans son discours à Nation, 17 décembre 2009, décréta la fin du dialogue et la réconciliation en République démocratique du Congo. After hearing from uh, the statements that have been made by Franco Eze, who is the head of delegations of the M23 here in the peace talks in the capital Kampala, the Foreign Affairs Minister of the Democratic Republic of Congo, Tishibanda, was upset by some of the statements that were made here at the summit. Uh, he, in retaliation, also made some conditionalities to the chief mediator that if the M23 uh, intended to proceed in that direction, then they will not be in position to continue with the talk. Faire une déclaration sur ce que exactement le M23 et ce que le M23 a commis comme crime 
dans la province du Nord Kivu, depuis que le mouvement a commencé. Si cet autogarien n'est pas donné, je ne pense pas qu'il y aura de suite à ces discussions. Je vous remercie. We came without conditionalities and we are ready for dialogue and we will not stop. We will not rest uh, until we have a, an agreement. That's our point of view, our stand since we came and we shall not change it. Now this marks the end of the first session of the talks and the beginning of the subsequent sessions that are going to take place to mark uh, the stable talks between the M23 rebels and the Kishajak government that are meant to return peace in the Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo. Timothy Spassi, the Biestar Vision, here at the Commonwealth Resort Hotel in the capital, Kampala.